In two weeks, Bartolo Colon turns 44 years old. He's been pitching so poorly, some Braves fans might not want him to reach his 45th birthday. The latest performance was an embarrassing first inning Tuesday night when he gave up five runs in the first and eight runs overall in a loss to Houston. Colon's ERA is now 7.22, which is awful. But here's the thing. Who cares? You might say, well, I do. I'm sick of watching that old and fat pitcher be awful every five days. I understand that, but again, who cares? Remember, Cologne was not signed by Atlanta to pitch a World Series game. They didn't bring him in to help win the division. The Braves signed this old pitcher, who is obviously running low on his batteries, to save his career, to simply buy a little more time for the young prospects who were almost ready for the big leagues. The Braves knew they had several pitchers, like five, who were candidates to join the Atlanta rotation between late 2017 and next season. So they signed Cologne and R.A. Dickey, who is 42, and traded for Jaime Garcia, a 30-year-old, in the last year of his contract. These guys are short-timers who are here only for this year. Only Dickey could be back next year as there is an option for his contract in next season. But don't bet on it. These old guys need to continue doing what they are doing, even if it means not helping the Braves win, as long as we can take it. In other words, we have to be patient and let those prospects develop a little while longer. We don't want the Braves to lose, but if it means the young pitchers can finish their development, who cares? This team was never going to win the World Series. It is year three of the rebuilding process. The last time the Braves did this, it took into the sixth season before they won. The Cubs just went through this. They won the World Series last October in year five of their rebuilding process. Teams don't win the World Series three years into a rebuild, so this is simply a bridge year to get the Braves from a losing team to a winning team, and that might take into next year. The last thing a team wants to do in a rebuilding process is to rush its players to get them to Atlanta before they are ready. Some could say that Matt Whistler and Aaron Blair might have been rushed, or at least perhaps just needed a bit more development. They were both highly rated prospects who have failed. Do we want that to happen to these kids who are needed? to help get the Braves back on track? No, let them develop. We're going to probably see Lucas Sims or Sean Newcomb or Patrick Weigel later this season, but it's still only May. Patience must be important in this world rebuilding process. We don't need to see them now, at least not yet. Let Cologne and Dickey and Garcia get as many innings as possible in Atlanta while those kids develop a little while longer. And if it means we must watch more bad games like Cologne had on Tuesday, who cares?